Here's a video of our trip to the Red Sand Beach on the road to Hana in Maui. Just to give you guys a heads up, this is a route that they say shouldn't be taken. They say a small part of it does cross private property and they said that it's very dangerous and tourists shouldn't do it. I don't think that it was very dangerous or treacherous for anyone that has relatively good hiking abilities. My dad went on it, my sister um, and her friend who are both relatively clumsy and we had no problems. We did see a couple of very elderly people and a couple young people that were having a lot of difficulty and should not have been on the trail as it is fairly narrow. But without further ado, we'll get into it. Um, once you pass the kind of private property um, that you just have to walk through this little area, you get to this relatively easy going trail and some gorgeous views with the ocean out to the right of you. Uh, there is like a hotel or something that you walk by right there in the background, but overall this is a very nice trail. There are some parts farther above that will get um, pretty narrow and also a little bit slippery just because of the gravel and just kind of the um, trail itself. Um, tourists and sites that you do look on do say that some of the trail has been washed out, which is what makes it a little bit more treacherous, but it wasn't originally on our plans to stop. We originally planned to stop at the Black Sand Beach because that is a little bit more well known. Um, but as you can see, the sign says dangerous right here. The We ended up getting there a little bit too late for our reservation as the Black Sand Beach did require reservations due to COVID. So we decided to try to find this spot, um, which we were able to find. Parking can be difficult, but if you can find parking, um, you're good to go. As long as you are in relatively good shape and feel confident in your hiking abilities, this is a pretty easy trail in my opinion. Like I said, there are some narrow areas that I'll try to show with the camera. Um, as I kind of videotape the whole way, it's a pretty short path. Um, but there are some amazing views and the Red Sand Beach is gorgeous. There's a lot of things to do. The water is crystal clear and it's pretty safe because of the way that the rocks kind of form almost like a reef. Um, type area. They kind of basically form like a little pool uh, by keeping the waves out of the area. So without further ado, I'll let you guys enjoy the rest of the video. This is the part that gets actually pretty narrow and you'll see here in a bit where you can um, see where it has been washed out a little bit um, as you can see there so I mean as rain comes it may get more washed out but for now it is a pretty decent trail if something this narrow does bother you I definitely would not recommend going on this trail um, but if it looks fine to you as you can see we're all walking pretty leisurely I got my shama sandals on and it's not that big of a deal This area right here does have a little bit of some brush and stuff, but you can typically just kind of walk around it or even just duck out of its way a little bit. And then the final little piece after you turn this corner does have like some steps and some large um, roots sticking out of the ground that you have to kind of step over. 
but as you can see there those rocks kind of block the wave so there's this nice resting pool there and you'll see how the sand has a red tinge to it kind of as you can see right now but as we get a little closer you will see it as well Last thing here, the water is super crystal clear, which was awesome. There were a few fish that we found. Um, I went and explored the other side over there. There was a lot of rocks and whatnot, other than pine needles. Uh, that's kind of all that there was. But this area of the beach is very secluded, very hidden. Um, I think there was three other people here that we saw the whole time that we were exploring. Um, so it's pretty secluded, which is awesome. And you get kind of a nice, peaceful relaxation surrounded by this gorgeous scenery. And here's kind of the red sand beach. It's almost like very small rock um, that kind of formed this beach falling off from the mountain surrounding it. But overall, it was a great experience. I would definitely recommend it if you feel comfortable with the hike and hope you enjoyed this video. And we'll see you next time.